Howdy folks, Gyro Jeremy here. Um, we recently bought a water, uh, water filtration system um, that periodically needs cleaning with a uh, recirculating water pump. Now I didn't want to have to go and buy a special water pump um, you know, for something that I might only use once or twice a year. Uh, so I come down to my little main cave and uh, come back with this. Um, it's just a little uh, 24 volt uh, water pump. Just a little 24 volt water circulating pump um, that works pretty good. And uh, I'd like to show you how I made it and the materials I used to make it work. Right, so I'll just run through this quickly with you. Um, how I made it, um, uh, and, I'll, and I'll pull it apart for you and, um, and show you the different pieces and, and what I used. Right, so what I started out with for the shaft uh, was just a piece of um, alum, aluminium rod. Um, on the for the impeller itself, I used a piece of 25 mm pipe. Uh, I just cut a piece off, about that much off the off the pipe, and then split it and folded the one side. Uh, back around on itself um, so it has a like an S shape uh, and then I just cut down the cut down the end of the shaft uh, bash that in there and cut a little wedge out of the top here so that the water um, has somewhere to enter the into the drum and uh, into the pumping chamber I guess you call it um, for the drum, I started out with the just this is a, just an offcut uh, piece of nylon. Um, um, so I started out with a block like this. Um, I s cut a, a slither off and faced up the surfaces. Um, I got a little lay there that I that I have in my shed. Um, so I faced up the surfaces. Uh, drilled the right size hole. I put plenty of clearance in there because I knew it wouldn't be, wouldn't have tight uh, tolerances in the in the pump anyway. Um, and then I bored out, I bored out the inside to roughly the depth of the um, impeller, um, so it roughly fits in there. And then. Uh, bored a hole in the middle for the intake and then bought a hole in the outside um, for the outlet of the pump. Uh, this is actually an old hose barb, uh, uh, like a double ended hose barb that I had lying around. Uh, so I just cut one end off and, and threaded the, put a thread, uh, cut a thread on the, um, on the on the cut end and then put a thread in inside the drum uh, and then all I had to do was uh, clamp that together and drill my holes um, to hold it all together and made sure that was all lined up and then um, just got some self tapping screws uh, all this stuff I have lying around the shed um, so this pump didn't actually cost me anything to build uh, apart from half a day's mucking around with it. Um, on the other end of the pump, on the shaft, um, I have this bit of hose. And this is just 
um, some sort of type of flexi drive. Uh, that way the, uh, the motor is not directly connected to the shaft uh, because if, if, there's, if, it's out, if it's out of alignment just a little bit eventually the, either the shaft of the pump or the, or the end of the shaft um, sorry the shaft of the motor or the, the pump shaft will break and crack off uh, just through out of misalignment uh, so that little bit of hose does the trick um, I just wrapped a bit of wire around there just to put a bit of tension on the on the um, that fits around that gear there holds it holds it in place um, now to hold the pump to stop the motor from spinning and turn the shaft I made up these uh, little bits of aluminium uh, strip and I just cut them out of a piece of uh, uh, three mil aluminium plate that I had lying around, um, and they're pretty self-explanatory. Screw them on there, and screw them on the side of the pump there, um, and that holds the holds the whole assembly together. Uh, this 24 volt motor is something I salvaged out of uh, an old printer. I think it came out of a printer. Um, um, which you know, which does the job nicely. Um, so I'll go and uh, set up a demonstration for you, and we'll see how it goes. All right, so we've got a bucket of water ready. Uh, got a 24 volt power supply, and we're going to connect our motor up to that. Our pump up to that. Yeah. 